Well, good morning. That's Larry. I'm supposed to be working on my car right now. My wife's wondering why I'm not. But I kind of felt forced into defending myself. Um, I posted a video talking about how I had, you know, 736 coins up to June 14th. And a month or so ago, I put one on saying at that point I had 365. Well, someone accused me of lying about the whole thing. They didn't accuse me of, you know, miscounting or miscalculating. Now they accused me of lying for some devious reason. And uh, otherwise, I wouldn't worry about uh, defending myself. But since they're saying I have some ulterior motive for saying that amount instead of going out working on my car before it got too hot I decided well I'm just gonna go ahead and count all the coins all over again maybe I didn't make a mistake you know maybe I miscounted the only reason I counted them at all to begin with I've had a couple people ask me you know how many I have all together and so I thought well okay I'll I'll count them up for me, it's not that big of a deal as far as how many I have. I'm kind of like, uh, if you ever see that Gold Fever show with Tom Massey, and I don't remember his exact quote, but he's talking about finding gold. He says, it's not having the gold, it's the searching for the gold. So it's the same way with me and the coins. You know, I, I mean, I like the coins, but it's not just having them and how many I have that's the big deal. The, the fun for me is going out and finding the coins. And then I just normally bring them home and throw them in beds and you know that's the end of it uh it wasn't until just kind of recently i've been checking the dates a little more so i don't even know the dates on all of them in there uh someday i'll probably you know put them all together maybe sell them or something meantime i just want to keep finding more that's that's the fun of it but it seems like somebody must feel i'm in competition with other ones and believe me i could care less about what other people get I don't care. If you get more than me, you got more than me. Who cares? But uh, so anyway, I got all the coins out, counted them all up, and I had forgotten too. I had given my wife, I don't know how many, three or four maybe recently to use in little uh, decorative things she makes. And then I lost, I, you know, who knows how many. I, I put a bunch when I was out collecting one time on my sort of like a little dash area in front of the odometer and I didn't realize there's a crack there and a bunch of them fell down in that crack and it's impossible to get them out so I don't know how many lost there I lost there then I know there's some that fell under the seat I haven't bothered with trying to dig them out yet you know there's probably two or three or four down there uh, then I I guess it sounds like just a couple days ago my wife said oh I found some of your coins in the washing machine or in the dryer so I leave coins accidentally in the in my pants and uh so, and then sometimes kids come over, I'll give them coins, you know. Anyway, after counting them all up, instead of coming to 736, I guess I am a liar. I only had 724 in my possession. So, I'm sorry. I was off by 11. And again, I'm not counting all the ones that are probably in my car somewhere. But I'm just going to take the lower number, 724. That's what I got. And that's my story, and I'm sticking to it. Like it or not. Okay, here's all the miscellaneous ones. A lot of them she has in baggies. But anyway, I added them all up. And there's like 55 of them here. Quarters, half dollars, silver dollars, gold coin, and large cents, and all kinds of stuff. Okay. So 55. Next we have buffaloes. And there's 112 buffaloes here. Anyway, there's 112. Okay, V nickels. We've got 51 V nickels all together. And I probably overall, I probably lost some coins. Every once in a while, my wife will find some in the washer. You know that I forgot to take out of my Levi's, and I've had some in the car drop down between things that I can't get out. So you know that's a minor amount though. Indian heads, 142 Indian heads here all together. Various qualities. So there's 342 Wheaties here. That a Wheaties. 
Here's the ones, this is ones I got from a different location some time back. I have those in another container, all separate, so I know exactly where I got them, how many I got, and so forth. Here's some more here I got, different location. Ones inside this box, I didn't get those, that has, my wife got them somewhere, but anyway. So, I keep everything separate. So, all together I have 724. There's three that I forgot that I had given to my wife. She makes little jewelry things out of it. Uh, 55 miscellaneous, 112 buffaloes, 342 Wheaties, 142 Indian heads, 51 V nickels, and 29 Mercs. So that comes to 724. I kind of scanned through my videos uh, this last month since I had since I posted 365 was my total May 10th or whatever it was. I looked through the videos. Now sometimes I'll kind of videos broken up and halfway through the video I'll mention I've got so many then later on and add some more so I kind of scan through real quick I don't want to you know waste my time going through all my videos but it looked like at least on those videos had the over 320 plus coins right there and I don't always take a video every time I go out sometimes I forget the camera I don't feel like messing with it so so right there, I mean, if somebody wants to waste their time going back through those videos, there's over 320-something coins in just the last month.